My friends and I went to Nashville for a bachelor rap party the day after Taylor Swift released her new album, The Tortured Poets Department, which wasn't planned on purpose but turned out to be a lot of fun and perfect timing. We stayed at Gaylord Orperland Resort for its beautiful tropical conservatory, as well as Soundwave, their indoor water park. There is a lot to see and do in this resort, including many different bars and restaurants, spa, boat ride, etc. So if you ever need a place to go for a relaxing weekend, this is the spot. On day two, we went to Tennessee State Museum, which surprisingly was free. Patty B's is Nashville's signature spicy chicken restaurant, so we had to try. There's always a line, but it moved fast enough. We tried mild because we saw reviews saying it's hot enough. However, even our friend who doesn't eat spicy food didn't think it was hot at all. So go for medium level at least if you'd like to taste some level of spice. Later that day, we had to Broadway Street aka the bar street for bar hopping and live music shows. We didn't stay in Nashville for long, only two and a half days. On day three, we tried the breakfast place many people recommended to us, Biscuit Love. Must try if you're in the biscuits. They're different from what you normally would find, but still pretty good. After eating breakfast, we head straight to a whiskey tour. Drinking whiskey and rum straight from barrels from a distillery was definitely worth the experience. You can also buy a customized bottle of whiskey if you like.
We also managed to check out the Parthenon as well as Taylor Swift's bench, which was only five minute walk away. Overall, Nashville was pretty clean and safe, and we all had a really fun time. Highly recommended for a girl's trip. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!